and welcome back to Sophie's Curse. This is part five, I think. And we're on 2 a.m. We're going to go from 2 a.m. to 4 a.m. Unless I keep dying and I'm unable to do it. Then this episode is just going to be me dying. We'll see and we'll find out. Let's get into it. Uh, it's going to be much harder. I'm probably going to die miserably. Uh, I'm not looking forward to it. It's especially like part... Part 4, going 12 a.m. to 2 a.m. was hard enough, but I was amazingly able to do it. Oh, okay, some neighbors complained about hearing screaming coming from the house. When the police arrived at around 10 p.m., Sophie answered the door. She said the screams were not coming from there. Police officers declared that she wasn't alone. They heard somebody else inside the house, and she told them she was with her mom. A few days later, the officer said Sophie saw Sophie's photo. One of them claimed that she was not the girl who opened the door, while the other officer said he was almost sure that it was Sophie. One month later, Clarissa was also reported missing. One day, he went to school. She never came back. Okay. At least reading those, the uh, the timers don't go downhill. Also, where's the save point? D. Let's get to D right now. Right fucking now. Before it's too late and I get raped by a ghost. Get the fuck over there. Mmm! Good timing. It just ran the fuck out of time. Now to go back to the laptop because I don't know where the save point is. I don't think I need to explain the rules anymore. If people are like, hey, why did you go there? Then I'm, I'm going to be a little upset at you. It's the D. Okay. Whoa, wait, shit. Everything's almost drained already. Jesus. Wow, that's, that's not cool. I don't know if it'd be a time where I'll need to worry about the error. Jesus. I don't think I'll need to worry about the errors too much because she uses the black flickery lights thing uh, really frequently enough where the errors really get reset and I don't need to worry about it. But I'm still going to double check to see how much I have on the timer on the laptop. Okay, let's see. I have, oh, 30. Okay, this is not a lot of time. Let's get this out of here. Green, green, on, on. Green, eight, six. Oh, fuck me. See, she did the light flickery shit, and I'm probably dead now. Left! Go, go! Fucking damn! That was close. As long as it's actually the D, and I'm not just running here for no reason. Okay. Good. Oh, fuck me. Jesus. Um, I just have to go to A. It's like, go as far away as possible. Fuck that. I almost clicked her, and that would have meant instant death. That would have been spooky. You're being a little relentless, you bitch. Jesus Christ. Hmm. Save point A. Good. Uh, any new messages? No. Okay. A. A it is. I don't think she'll do the light flickering ASAP, so I'm going to get rid of the D and the C recharging stations. So, ladder... Uh... The later cranking is, of course, close to the save point. This makes more sense that way. Good. Get downstairs. There we go. Okay. So far... Just gotta be careful of fucking A. It's, it's really getting low. And there we go. We're doing good. Uh, it's almost been 30 minutes. But A is the save point. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna stay right here. It's just great, you know? He's gonna do the light flickery shit any fucking moment. Like I fucking said, right any fucking goddamn fucking moment. <clears throat> and you did. But I'm in the safe zone. She can't t fucking touch me for whatever fucking reason. Thank you for recharging my batteries, by the way, Sophie. Or maybe the ghost is Clarissa. Maybe. Since there's now a story element to this. D. Great. The safe point is the D. We're just going to, you know... I'm just going to casually beat the game. I'll hang around the D a little bit more. Grandpa seems to be lively tonight. Let's see how Grandpa is. I'm going to click Grandpa, see anything like something happens. No, no, no. Like, I wonder if there's like Easter eggs in the game, or if I click something long enough, something happens. Error. No, clicking Grandpa causes errors. That's called Alzheimer's. Uh, should I just stay here? I bet she's gonna do the light flickery thing any second too. As soon as I go down there, it's gonna be like, oh hey, light flickering. Probably. 
I, I, I just don't want to be at the laptop when it happens, because it save points fucking D. I, I, I just... Uh... Just, like, take my word. I'm not going to be able to finish this. It'll, it'll do the light flickering, and I'll be spooked as I rush to the D. Seven, zero, six, five... No, I... No, 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 no. One, one, six... Fuck me. It did it. It did it. It did it! Run faster, you whore! My legs are too slow. Oh. <sighs> I have plenty of time here, it looks like. Maybe he reduced the difficulty. Because look at this, I have all this spare time for running still. Mm -mm. Maybe I don't need to be as worried about being at A and needing to run to D or vice versa. Maybe I'm just stressing out about it too much. Save point is D again. And the electricity is running out fast, as usual. <sighs> okay. I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm just getting good at this game or they reduce the difficulty. God damn it, I just charged that, you little bitch. And why isn't B being moved at all? It's like only two drain at once? I I, I don't get it. Also, I can't remember if it was the D as a save point or A, so I'm gonna have to really double check that. My memory is shit. What is it? What is it? What is it? It's it's D. And D needs fixing. Of course. Of course it does. Grandpa it breaks the D too much. Uh, fuck, mate. Oh, God, this... Fast, fast, fast. Fast? Oh, God, damn it. See, that, that was much shorter. I didn't have as much time to run to the fucking save point. Ugh. It's quite startling. It's, like, really random. You don't know if it's gonna be... A long chance. I don't know. Like, what's the determination that makes it so you have a long time to run and it's very, very lenient? And uh, what I just dealt with right now, which was I just ran up the stairs. I was going as fast as fuck possible. I, I just wasn't given the chance. There was absolutely no opportunity to win unless I was closer to it. So it's just like, like I said, f fixing, fixing the bulbs doesn't seem to be worth it because by the time the time runs out of you needing to fix the thing here it's like it gives you 40 50 seconds by that time she'll do the light flickery shit and you might as well just prioritize being closer to the save point or charging the batteries and not worrying about the errors um yeah i'm just gonna do that from now on fuck the errors unless it's about to run out uh, that, that jump scare really woke me the fuck up I'm gonna be doing time skipping now from now on until interesting thing happen. Ugh, interesting things happen, because I'm just gonna be trying to progress back to 3 a.m. So I'll see you in a bit. Save point is D. So I'm gonna use this example. I have 65 seconds to fix B, but the save point is at D. So I'm gonna say fuck this error, and I'm going to just not work on it. I'm gonna stay in the safe zone and see what happens. It's probably instant death if I don't fix it, but I don't know. I'm gonna hope that my my strategy. No, oh fuck, and she, and and she broke, and she broke D. D is the save point if I remember though. How? D. See, prioritize being the save point unless D wasn't the save point and it's actually A, and I completely forgot and I fucking myself over right now. And I gotta prepare myself for the jump scare. And it's not good. Okay. Let's find out what the other save point is. I'm going to keep going at my strategy of fuck the errors, I don't give a shit. They give you too much time to fix it, but if they didn't, you'd be fucked. Cause. I mean, it's obvious. Uh, A. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Jesus, that was right in my face. Somewhat. I had to run to the D. There we go. Alright. Safe and sound. The save point was A, but it's likely going to change. Um, yeah. Spooky. Very spooky. It is, no, it's still A. Okay. Uh, I, I guess that's good. But yeah, that's a 
ranting. The errors don't matter, they give you so much time, but they understand that as the difficulty rises, she's going to be more difficult. Now what is the way that she can be difficult? It is of course by making it so she does the light flickering shit more often. Making it so you have more chances at fucking up or not- Oh fuck me, like right now I'm fucking dead. This is too far away and she's gonna give me a short amount of time and jump scare me like right fucking now! No, I'm safe. I was closing my eyes and embracing the cold, shadowy embrace of death. The virtual ghost girl. Fuck. Just fuck this. Oh my god. And the jump scare really got me. I'm I'm going to probably enjoy and emphasize my facial reaction as I get. Holy fucking Christ! Wait. Um. Hold on a tick. I don't know where the save point was. Was it D or was it C? My attention to that very important detail was very much uh, missing. I'm going to check the laptop and hope she doesn't do the fucking light flickery shit again. I think it was D. It was D. Okay. So, as per what I was saying about fuck the errors, I'm going to just linger right here. Because, you know, I bet she's going to do the light flickery shit before the error timer runs out. If true, I'm going to stop talking about it because I'm just going to have it confirmed. But if not, and the errors continue going until I die, then fuck me. Come on, bitch! Where are ya? Waiting for you. Yep. She's dead. Safe zone. The whole element of trying to balance errors of resetting a laptop is a redundancy. You don't need to do it. Because the difficulty rises by her doing this, and I, I just don't need to worry about the errors. So, game developer, this is a good tip. I mean, as much as it, it's like uh, Five Nights at Freddy's, where you need to multitask certain tasks, like cranking the musical box. If they, they, they don't work together, they're not in flow, they're not in synchronization. They sort of work against each other. <sighs> well, okay, so it is 3 a.m. I'm doing quite well. I'm um, using my theory, or not theory, but I wouldn't even call it theory anymore. It's it's a strategy now. The whole fuck the uh, fuck doing the whole error shit. I don't need to touch the laptop. I don't need to fix anything. It, it, oh fuck, she's right. She's right there. Run, Jesus Christ, she's killed me. Wow. I I was waiting at the B, knowing the save point was D. Because uh, I was hoping for her to do the whole, you know, light flickery shit, and I just simply click and go to the D, but instead she appeared in front of me. I almost clicked her and almost died. But that's what the developer wants. Fuck you, developer. You almost got me killed. And that would have made me sad. I think the. Uh, this is gonna be really, really questionable. I have to get to the D save point, and I have to fix B. Okay, this... I swear the save point is fucking D. I'm gonna double check. It could fuck me over, though. It is... it is D. Okay, let's get the fuck over there. She's gonna do the light flicker shit any fucking second. Any fucking second, like, seriously. Come on! Yep. Alright, going to the D. I was waiting for this specifically. There's no errors on the laptop, however, it had been a while since she did the whole like, late flickery bullshit. Okay. Doing good, doing good. With this whole strategy of not having to worry about the errors, everything- <laughs> Oh! Seriously? Seriously? As much as that might be maybe confusing to other people, I think I know why that happened. Um, in the first episode or the second episode, there was a situation where she crawled from A and under the table like this little creepy spider thing. I think that is what was happening. She was crawling there, aka if you click here, you're fucking dead because I'd move closer to her. So I'm assuming I clicked so fast before the animation actually showed it that I died because I clicked towards her instead of away from her. So that is the reason why you don't uh, you don't rush 
in every direction because there's the chance that she'll appear in front of you like that and kill you. And unfortunately for me, I was about to win. And she apparently went, appeared in front of me and, and I, I clicked her and she killed me on the spot for not waiting. If you rushed, there's that chance of dying like that. But either way, I, that's unfortunately, I guess, part five of this episode. I, I tried my best and I died too many times. So maybe in the next episode, I'll beat fucking 2 a.m. But for now, I'm going to leave it here. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and hit that subscribe button to become a subscriber. And until the next episode, <clears throat> there we go. The lights actually still work. That's good. Great haunted house. Nope.